Alright, hey, what is up, YouTube? Is my microphone on here? I believe it is. Well, I guess you might have seen the videos of me and Killer743 trying to do our best to inform you on the new items coming out. Me and him are drastically excited to the extreme of these new weapons. Um, I, I stated earlier in a video that the... Uh, Ex extra large gunner eight or whatever is a Gatling gun. I'm not so sure about that. It is a machine gun, which does require 120 20 machine gun, and it has super fast fire, like a fucking fast fire speed. Um, I as you can see, I do not have anything equipped because I did sell it all. I am 100% going for the um the new guns and new items i don't know about the armor i can i think i can live without the armor for a little bit but when i seen that they had the uh new items in like the stuff updated i just wanted to get back to fort pastor as fast as i could to end that loot run i don't know why maybe some of you will think i'm stupid um i still do have the exact same items from my last video that hasn't changed uh, I did MC though the Chris Vector, just a little bonus there for me I guess. Um, I found I I did find some new items from last last time though, so th that's a bonus. Um, still very very excited. I actually was working at the time. I was on my lunch break whenever I found this out, so I didn't have very much time. And me and Killer weren't able to discuss into detail like I kind of we kind of made the video on a fly because I had a, about a half an hour left of my lunch break. Um, I'll, me and him will probably, I will see if I can get him to make another future video, maybe a, a further video describing a, in greater detail when the stuff is supposed to be happening. Um, I'm just going to show you what I did find. Obviously, um, I am scrapping everything besides that. That is probably the only high level thing that I can sell for a lot at the moment. Um, I bet some of you are mad when you watch my videos because I scrap everything and the reason being is because if you can't I mean some people think that oh well let's just go ahead and sell it over a few K over scrap price that's making profit but then you'll sit there for a few weeks and it'll just not get bought and it'll finally be bought that to me isn't making a profit because in those days you could die a few times and lose money but what I do is if I take like let's say I found these katanas I found two of them now I no, they aren't really worth a whole lot anymore, so I just go ahead and scrap them now. Um, but, like, see, this is worth 200k, I think. I must, and if I'm overpricing, then that is my bad. Last time I checked, it was. Chicago typewriters, I have checked, they are only worth about a few more thousand dollars than what they are. Scrap value, so I'm just actually going to scrap both of those right now. Um, I was deeply deeply surprised that the items had their full stats and everything eat all of them at the like exact same time because when corpse was being dropped off i remember he had the corpse shooter i think that was the first one or was that the corpse carapace either way one of those two came first and like they were the only ones with the stats at the time and he dropped all of the stats for all the guns at the same time which is surprising and i I know me and Killer said they would be coming out maybe in two to three days time, which is like the greatest thing that we could hope for, but it could take up to another week because we never know with coding errors. Um, if it is, if it does take up to that, I'm sorry for those of you who got your hopes up in that video. Um, just kind of doing some rethinking. I, You can see I'm just right now keeping the XM8 hovering over that. Um, the XM8 is... It's it's still it's about the same thing as a Chicago typewriter, so I'm just gonna go ahead and scrap that as well. And this was three to four days. I remember in my last video I said that I would be going to Easy on Sunday. Well, it is Sunday, in a few hours here, and I don't think I'm going to be going there with nothing. I could equip all of this, but I'm strictly in it for the profit right here. I'm not, uh, uh, how does one say, I'm not stingy with cash, but I do not want to give my cash away just because you ask or beg for it repeatedly. 
um, but I do have a system in which I do make money off of and that is for one time one of my friends when I first started playing about two well I've played since 2D but back when 3D first came out I quit playing because I got mad and this random guy said I'll tell you what I'll give you 20k and if you can prove to me that you ain't gonna be a nub and lose it all and he just said that um, it's do or die with this money he said that if you can get it up to a pretty good amount of money I you will be alright so he gave me 20k and expected me to be really good with it and I didn't have any system of saving money at the time and I'm telling you my system of saving money at the time what I did when it, with 20k is I saved up like every 5k I would not go under 25,000 make another 5k wouldn't go under 30,000 down and or so on and so on and then like let's say this then you get up to a hundred thousand and then you make ten thousand then you don't go under a hundred K which means you still have ten thousand dollars to spend on yourself now when you get to a million you don't go under a million but if you have five hundred thousand that is your spending limit and that is really good that is a very big budget um, which is what I have been doing and I now have a large amount of money I will not um, except begging or any of that I don't appreciate that please don't beg if you do I won't be mad at you it's just that I will not um, look at those the same way and I now have two hundred and two thousand off of this right now in scrap and these things are worth eleven thousand more than their scrap value that is a pretty big chunk of change in difference but they do not sell very fast I have had this thing on the market all week or for the three days that I've had it and I've gone to the trading they did not sell so bye bye and I will find many many more so I'm not worried about it some of you are thinking what are you doing don't do that I loot easy frequently I will find many many more and possibly the new items are coming out I may find a bunch of those um, once again I am so excited about the new videos not even kidding um, I'm contemplating on whether or not to sell or scrap this. Um, hmm. So I did look up the price for the Dragon SVD. Sorry for the rude pause and interruption, but that is two hundred thousand right there. I will be putting, which is this is if that sells, that'll be my most expensive loot run ever. I think last time I made two hundred and fifty-six thousand off of what I found. Um, this wasn't a very big loot run compared to my first one, which surprisingly was still my biggest one. Oh, but that, oh, never mind. I guess I did sell that, uh, MC Chris Victor for a few, few amount. And that didn't even put a dent to my money. That is surprising. I've never thought I'd have that much money. But, um, thank you for viewing my videos, even though they aren't very popular at the moment. I, uh, appreciate you taking the time to listen to me babble and ramble um leave comments of course i will read your comments um i don't do this for subscribers i just do this for fun um i do not just sh i'm not showing off what i find i'm just showing you um what nez can bring you and recently i've been finding out that nez is a little bit better than south end zone the only difference is, is that you have to make a bigger trek to and easy to be able to loot um the south end zone i don't know if it has any hospitals from but from what i'm hearing it sounds like it doesn't but each hospital in nez has a hundred possible loot locations um and then you have warehouses prisons schools uh offices multi-building multi-level buildings it is just crazy at the amount of loot you find um, the market there is, ki I'm not going to lie, it is kind of bad, but the more people that you get out there, the more people, there's going to be a bigger market. And there's a lot of people in South End Zone right now because it's easier to get to and it's, uh, grinding, I guess it's a grinding choice is one main reason. You can easily grind. I grind out there. It's not really grinding, but I run around with a melee weapon and I put on 961,507 EXP in two days. Um, with just that Nodachi. It isn't impossible. It is very likely that you could do the exact same thing. The only things that I would recommend is that you have a very high agility, critical hit, accuracy, or you have a silent weapon. If you don't have a silent weapon, you'd better be pretty good with a machine gun or a shotgun of your choice. 
Um, it's pretty dangerous up there. There are random agro spikes, and they have killed me many times. Um, but like I said, thanks for watching this video. Um, I, me, and Killer743 will probably be updating, making more videos of the items as we, as I learn, or as he learns more about them. Um, some of which you may already know. Sorry. So if you have heard the information over and over again, sorry for repeated information. Um, that is not our goal. We are just trying to get it out there so that more people will know what is coming out. Um, uh, thanks for watching, I guess.